Okay, so today we're gonna work on Cinnamon Girl. This is a really killer Neil Young song. Okay, so today we're gonna work on Cinnamon Girl. This is a really killer Neil Young song. And as usual, I've modified it a bit, so we'll have some different layers. So here's the first layer, okay? I'm gonna start with this guitar riff, which is single notes, so... And I'm gonna do a close-up in a second, so don't worry. Here's the tab and a close up. So we want to do index finger and ring finger. And then we can either do middle, index, index, ring. Or you can do um, ring, middle, open, index. So just for that little walk down, the two options are Middle, middle index, then index, ring, or ring middle. Okay, so that whole thing again. Go ahead and try it. Okay, here's layer two for the intro. Uh, this is going to be for anyone who's ready to try it with power chords, all right? We're going to do the same thing except the very first um, couple notes. We're going to turn those into power chords. So it's going to be a C power chord to a D power chord. So right here, here we go. I'll have a diagram here. C power chord and deep the D power chord. Okay. So you can slide from the C to the D power chord like that, or you can just pick all of them. We're doing all down strokes right now. If that's if you're not ready for that just stay with the single note you could try the slide actually with your with one finger with the index to get ready for that all right so that whole thing will look like this with the power chord guys here comes the verse we're gonna start the verse out with some simple chords okay we're gonna go D to a minor to C to G and then we're gonna have a, a variation of that intro riff So here, let's go back. We're going to do some strumming here. I simplified this a little bit. So we're going to go down, down, down. Okay. And then the A minor, same thing. C. G. Then we have 
this riff. Cool. So we're doing all downstrokes. If you want to play the, if you know the full chords, the full A minor, the full C, the full G, you can do that. So I'm just going to do these modified ones. So the next layer we can add to this would be um, obviously full chords. So D, full D, full A minor, full C, and then actually the G is going to be only if you're ready to do this. This is actually called G slash B. A couple ways to do this. So if you made a full four finger G, we're just gonna take away the low E string. So take away the middle finger. So we start on the second fret A string. And we can just play it like that. Okay, it looks like this. So again, D, A minor. B. Okay, and then we're gonna have, we're gonna add power chord to the C and D again, and then that A minor, we're gonna just make that a power chord at the end of this riff, so it'd be like... That would sound like that whole verse. for a little bit. Indiana wants to say hi. Indiana, say hi. Come here. You want to say hi? Come here. Come here. Jump up. Here comes the bridge. Bridge is a little strange in this song. I don't know. You might not think so, but I, it's just a weird, it's a little weird. So we're just going to play C for three measures. I'm going to do these modified versions, so... Okay, and then we're going to switch to a G minor. We're going to do a modified G minor. So that one's like this. go to A5, A, which is an A power chord. Oh, actually, I'm sorry, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go like this. We're going to go and then turn it into a full A. So depending on which fingering you use for that, we're doing an A power chord with three strings. I'll do it with this one. So here, here, and here. And then we just add the B string second. 
fret. So we start off just these three, A, A string, D string, G string. Then we add the B string. So let's go back to the C chord, the strum pattern. We're, we could just do all down strokes for this because it's pretty slow. Okay. And then we go right to that G minor. Same thing. Then the A5, all down, A major. All right, so work on that for a second, and then we'll move on to the next part. All right, guys, so for the solo, there's a guitar solo, which actually happens over the verse. So we'll just do the verse again. So the guitar solo starts happening over the verse. I'm gonna do the modified verse, here it is. power chord version of that you would go on the very end that's the very ending and we're sliding again you could also pick all of them or do the slide all right nice job do this All right, guys, let's play through it. Let's play through the whole thing. This is 80% um, speed, so I think you could all probably hang with this, all right? I'm gonna play the modified version, like all the, all right, all the single note stuff and the modified chords, all right? Let's do it.